So today I'm in front of one of my favorite neighborhoods. This is Paradise Palms in Las Vegas. If you like vintage homes, you will love this one. It just has some really special attributes. So let's go check it out. You know what, before we go inside, these three palm trees were actually donated by Neil Diamond back in the 70s. According to the seller, that's freaking crazy, that amount of history. So this home was built in 1976, and what's really cool about it is that even though they did a lot of renovations, and the people like that, you know, you got new floors, new paint, new cabinets at some point in its career, they still left some of the original touches, which we're gonna get into in just a minute. Talking about original touches, this is my favorite part of the whole house. They kept the original wet bar from 1976, and then they picked up these beautiful stools from the Tropicana Casino. How freaking Vegas and cool is that? Now, the lighting in this home, for the most part, has been replaced with more current style lighting fixtures like this one right here. I really like the vibe, it's really cool, but if you wanna get that authentic Las Vegas vintage home, something like this is probably gonna be more your style. Okay, cool, so they kept one of the lighting fixtures in here. This is, uh, it's interesting. Almost reminds me of, I don't know if you remember, like Janet Jackson's like earring thing going from like her nose to her ear to here, I don't know. Kind of cool, kind of weird. Now this is the primary bedroom. It's pretty large, like this is a full-size king bed and all of the bedrooms, as you're gonna see, are real big. One of the things about a home like this is a lot of these homes are unique, which can also mean it feels like a maze. Like this hallway I'm in right now, you have an offshoot over here to the bar, you've got bedrooms, and like a turn. When you're living here, it's fine. But this bedroom's freaking huge. Ceilings, they're a little over eight feet, so it doesn't feel claustrophobic at all. A lot of the times with older homes, I kind of notice that the ceilings are pretty low. So this shower actually reminds me so much of going to a bank or credit union. You just like shove the thing in there and the vacuum thing sucks it up. Except for you get clean in it. Now, this used to be a carport and they've gated it off, which gives you more access to have kids play out here longer, dogs run around, and just kind of enjoy all of that 11,000 square feet, which is just a little over of a quarter of an acre. I don't know what the heck this is, but I kind of like it. Now, what I like even more is if you're thinking about quintessential Vegas neighborhood, like this mid-century style, you have to have a pool, and this one has a pool and a casino that you could use as a pool house. Now for the stats, it's just under 2,800 square feet. It is four bedrooms and five bathrooms. You have one of the bedrooms right here in this casita behind me. And what's really cool about Paradise Palms is it's a very community focused neighborhood. You're not in a HOA, but these neighbors care about their homes. There's a very high pride of ownership. It's a very tight knit community and they do events almost monthly. So if you have any interest in living here or moving to Las Vegas or finding out about your perfect place to live, contact me. And this home is listed at $700 $77,000. It's a lucky number. 